I say it to me, boss man. I'm not used to feeling saying my name out loud. Can I not just say the name? Shatter, shatter, shatter. You're not mixing with the right people. All his fans don't have the good music. Wrong DJ, that's Damia Kadabi. No, 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 take it. Africa. Lyrics, I could tell was trash. Because, you know. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't know, now you know that we get in this bitch with James and me. Fuck, fuck. Like that, oh, you yeah, can't, innit? Fuck. Alright, sorry. What? <laughs> is it recording? Like the, yeah. Is it recording? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Apparently, I can't swear. Bitch. <laughs> Obviously, follow me on Insta at Don't follow Marcel him. underscore London. Follow me on Snapchat at If I got if I told you guys what Shaq did the other day. I plugged you. Oh sha Don't worry. Oh it went, it went good. Tamika's trying to pull a Beyonce stunt on us, isn't it? She did Beyonce for this film, look at her. Yep, yeah, she's putting on powder like she, she's powdering up as if she's <laughs> Hey I was telling them how you were pulling the Beyonce number just to just, just to come Okay, so we're gonna drive the car, yeah right. What's up people? It's Corbin Captures and I'm here with I'm cool with catches and today I'm here with Tamika Bossman. So today I'm here with Tamika Bossman. So Okay, so <laughs> move in man. Move in man. How do I say it? Tamika Bossman. No. I'm not used to really saying my name out loud. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't just say the name. No, but say it like at least be like her. Oh, Hi guys, to be boss man, what? What's up people, Kobe Capture's back. What's up, Corbin gang? The, the boss man's, the, the, yeah. Squatch. Why did oh, that man. sound so... God! <laughs> oh. Let's carry on with life, let's just carry on with life, please. <laughs> it's shock! Okay, so, if you know me, you know, I find Afro beats a bit too much for my soul. Like, it just, it's too much for me, like, it's too much. I'm from the Caribbean. It's not that I listen to uh, all dance or all Jamaican music. I just like normal music, like like a mixture of everything. Afrobeats is normal. Afrobeats is normal, yeah. But it's like when it's there for like more than 20 seconds in the party. I I, I don't know. Like it's time for it's me. It's obvious because you're not listening to the right Afrobeats song. Exactly that. Maybe maybe that. Maybe not. But today I'm going to try and listen to Afrobeats. So obviously I had to call on Miss Tamika Bossman over here who is a co-host on Represent Radio that hosts a show all about Afrobeats music. What's the name of the show? It's called the BOA Show. It stands for Beats of Africa. I'll put that on the screen there. Yeah. Um, and I what do days can we listen to you? Every other Thursday. So I'm going to be on this first. Well, it depends when this week. <laughs> this Thursday? Yeah. yeah, this Thursday. So like the other... Every other Thursday. Please yeah, every other Thursday this, from yeah. 2 to 4. And um, it's actually DJ Pox's show, amazing Afrobeats DJ. Mm -hmm. If you wanna like Afrobeats, listen to DJ Pox's mixes. Are you gonna <laughs> or listen to my playlist? Like I, I bring up playlists every Thursdays. I'll put all the links yeah. down below. I've been slacking, but you know we're gonna try. You know life gets ahead of us sometimes. But yeah, I see her having a right old boogie on Dan on yeah. her Snapchat. So yeah. I just thought, why not bring her along and maybe she might convert me. So, um, we made an agreement that, um, so she's gonna play me a song, um, she's gonna say a bit about the song, and then I'm gonna listen to the song and I'll tell you whether it's a bop or flop. Mm. Honestly, honestly, I'll give everything a chance. Based, should we make it in categories? So like, based on lyric, lyric? Ly Lyrics, but we're not gonna listen to that much, so maybe beat? Okay, so production level, I'll call it. Uh-huh. Yeah. I say, yeah, lyrics. Lyrics. And just a vibe. Yeah, just a vibe. Vibe, lyrics, and beats. Because that's that's what keeps me listening to a whole song. So yeah, we're going to do some things. like laid back, just vibe and Afrobeat music. And we're going to do like 
dancey ones as well, ones that have dance moves. Yeah, like sure. The first song we're gonna get into is um, Stone Boy featuring Kojo Funds. Fool Kojo, him. UK boy. Yeah. But he's Ghanaian. Yeah, he's a Ghana, so is, is Ghana, Ghana a, boy. Yeah. Oh wait, just to go up, is there a Ghanaian Afro beats and is there like a Nigerian Afro beats? But it's all Afro beats. Like okay. Afro beats, if you're African and you have the Afro beat music, beat, it's Afro beats, isn't it? Okay. But then we have UK Afro beats and we have African, African. So wait, is I'm um, Kojo talking in Twi here? I don't think he does, you know. Okay. He doesn't. He's not really full on with it because obviously he does his own genre of music. Okay, okay. But let's yeah, go. fool. This one is falling again. This song is like we had Stoneboy actually come on the show and he was explaining and he was telling me I had a good explanation of the song. Big up to Stoneboy because he know me smart. <laughs> but yeah, and it's just like um, a girl is like another one falling again. That's the chorus. So it's just like. You know, got another boy falling again. You know, I think it kind of explains me. You know, the niggas be falling. I'm joking, joking. You see what I mean? Girls just take every song to heart and I'm they mean joking. it when they say these I'm just lyrics. joking. I'm just joking. No, but they're singing their Snapchat and they mean it. It's like true. you mean it. Like, like they mean it. When they're listening to music, they mean it. Before they go to that party, they're pumped and they mean it. <laughs> That's yeah. what you call mean it. Hashtag mean it. Anyway, <laughs> let's get into this. Yeah. I like the beat already. Oh, no, no, no. They're giving me a nice song. I've never heard it That doesn't sound like Afro beats. But he does Afro dance. That's a different. But that doesn't sound like Afro beats. Well, he does Afro dance or is a. That mix sounds like of... something I'd be calm with hearing in the club. But it's Afro beats. He's an Afro beat. Well, he's an Afro dance or I. So it's a bit of both. But what is Afro dance or? It's a mixture of Afro beats and dance or. So like, whereas he's beating. Have I been under a rock stuff. or something? I've never heard that. You're not mixing song. with the right people. All his friends don't know the good music, and I said it. Like, <laughs> Oh, that, that so here I am, and I'm here to help you out. So yeah, how would you rate that song? Anyways? That was a bop. That was definitely a bop. Um, in uh, lyrics, I didn't really understand. Wait, no, 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 lyrics. Oh no, lyrics. I didn't hear lyrics too tough, but I know. I just these Afrobeat artists, you know, some of them don't be speaking a lot of words. <laughs> <laughs> but in like, that, I heard, I heard patwa. I heard like patwa. Mm -hmm. I know when I, I know I heard patwa. Um, vibe was a good vibe. It was a good production, the beat was good, and lyrics is a default because you know. But yeah, all of I say that was a good thing. That was a good, that was a good one. That was a 100% bop. The next song I'm gonna play is Sonna, Feeling You. Sonna's a UK Afrobeats artist. So oh, yeah, Sonna was down in my uni over there. Is it? He's Nigerian, but I think he was born here and he does Afrobeats with him. In fact, the UK. that's what Sonna included in the other day, around my birthday. Anyway, carry on. So, he does UK Afrobeats. Mm. So yeah, this is feeling, this is another vibe. I really, really like. When I first heard this song, um, Pox played it on the show, and I was just like, what is Son this? has got fans, by the way. But then Girls, I heard it. He girl. is, mm, God But yeah. But yeah, this one is really good for feeling you, you know, the title of the song says it all. So let's get into this let's one. Let's hear it. You taught me playing the right things. How about they start playing the right music in parties? Get the right DJ at your event. <laughs> okay, okay. Get, that's the, nah, that is actually a thing. That, because that some DJs, music. get your right DJs. 
Cause I like I like my I like who's my my favorite other DJ. I love the DJ Pox, we all know. Mwah. DJ Qualms. I like a DJ Skrills, YBE. He used to do Afrobeats all the time. I don't know if he does. DJ Lodi. DJ. Wrong DJ. That's Jamaica, Jamaica. No, 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 no. Take it. It's Africa. You got, I, that's what I think it is. You need to have the right. Because I even went to an Afrobeat um, rave the other day. Yeah. Or well, club, whatever. Whoever the DJ was, like, he was playing nice music, but he wasn't mixed. You see, you can have the right <laughs> songs. But if you're not mixing it well, and everyone's just being attacked by the mix. He was even playing the songs over and over. How many times do you want us to hear this song? Huh? How many times do you want us to shaku shaku and all this? No, wrong. <laughs> but I just think you have to get the right wrong. DJs. Shit, wrong. <laughs> you have to get the right DJs for your events, okay, guys? Get. Because then James is just going to think Afro beats and shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, lyrics I could tell was trash. <laughs> Because you know what it. He's being rude. Sorry, Sada. Okay. <laughs> Production's a bot. Production's a bot. Vibe was a. Bop? Yeah, I'm never going to take it. Vibe from you. was a. Mm, mm, mm. Vibe was a. Mm. We'll bop it. We'll bop it. And that obviously that makes it. They said lyrics bop. were trash. The lyrics was just... Do you know what it is with a lot of music, yeah? I would say as well. I'm really all for the lyrics. Like, I really like lyrics of songs. I'm so... I was good at English, you know? But I think, yeah, when when you're alone and you have your headphones in, <laughs> and you're listening to a song, and you listen to the song... Mm, figure, what's he to... Oh, I see what he's talking about here. <laughs> yeah, well, that makes a bit of sense. So, I think... Nah, man, I think it was whatever, man. It was alright. The song was alright. So we'll give it a bop. A we'll bop. give it a bop, but a lower bop than the first one. Well, the first one full, okay. The first one was a 100% bop. Because it had pep twine it, but yeah. Next. Let's get into the next song. Next song. Okay, the next song I'm going to play is Mr. Easy. Oh, I like Mr. Easy. This one is called Pour Me Water. Hey, wait, what? Did he jump on a song the other day that I liked? He's really jumping on a lot of songs. Decline? Ray? Ray? Ray. Ray who? Ray. Ray? You've never heard of Ray? No, who's that? She's light skin. She. Oh, I think she's a Yeah. Yeah, I think. You heard the song? Yeah. My sister was going on about it, apparently. He's really. Like, do you I like about him? He's very, like, here and there. He likes to try and It's because that's where you make your money in the industry, It's no? true, you know. So, yeah, bring up Mr. Queen. Easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's play his one. He brings a new. a new sound. Boom, me, water. Listen, that's his trademark. Everywhere. It's your boy, it's your boy easy. easy. Dirty, 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 dirty. I love it. It's E. Oh, baby. Pour me water. Holy water. When you fly. Oh, my God, please. Pour me water. Some holy water. Make it when this fly. Everybody want me, make I no fall in love. That is very sexual. But I know I'm sorry. I don't see this very sexual. And he went to say holy water. I just realized. He said pour me water. What? Pour me water. Woo! Holy water. Hey! Guys, he's getting the lyrics. I love it today. So, yeah, that's that did one. Did you just deep what he said? Look at me deep, because we're going, we're going. Let's go to lyrics straight. Wait, did you just deep what he said? He said, he said, pour me water, holy water, so I can, so you can catch this fire. What fire? God forbid. What fire? Don't People be a bit listen sexy to their lyrics, innit? I'm screaming. He also said in the song, he said, anybody would me and make I no fall in love with you. Basically, he's telling me I shouldn't fall in love with you. Is that Nigerian? But I think it's like Nigerian link. The pigeon is what they <laughs> he linked speak. linked it with two different and cultures. He said, said. But I no answer them. He's not listening to them. I tell them, say, now you. So basically, he's saying that he's saying that anybody would him not to fall in love with the girl, but he's not mad at them because he's telling them it's that girl boy. I get that one. Yeah, we are cool. We all I can like relate. They tell you not to go for that boy, yes. and then you go for that boy, and when that boy breaks your heart, then you don't understand. But everyone wants you oh. all. Yeah, I can tell you one of those girls that will write the lyric on the screen, and it means everything to you. Trust me. The whole lyrics means I'm, everything. Like every word means. It. Okay. I'm actually that girl. We'll give him. Boy. We'll give him. Mr. Easy's a bop. All, all the, everything he does is a bop. It's a but bop, we'll give yeah. him a bop for the vibe. We'll give him a bop for lyrics, and we'll give him. A bop for 
production because his music is very well produced. Like it just comes in nicely. It's not attacking me. It's not like drums, boom. <laughs> you know. <laughs> But yeah, okay. So the next song yeah. is gonna be David Doe with Fire. <sighs> David Doe had a concert, guys, and I didn't go, and I'm so upset. Like, I think about it all the time that I didn't go. It really upsets me. <laughs> Wait, what? He will come you, back to love them, hopefully. Do you know what it is? Because I don't know who whose songs is who. Like, I don't know who David Doe is. So I'm like, who's, why is everyone going to David Doe concerts and spending off their money for you his You don't know who billion? David Doe is? I don't know who's, what's his songs. I've heard his songs, but I don't know what's his songs. James is, boy, I need to take James to some places because, anyway, let's just get into it. This one called Fire. They don't spell it F-I-R-E, F-I-A. Oh, is that F-I-A one? A fire. Oh, I feel like I don't like it already, but let's hear it. No, because I think I've heard it. Okay. It's let's the one go. where we go, can we turn it off, please? Let's go. Yeah. Fire, fire, fire. Nah, you know what it is? Lloyd has played this song so many times around me. And it's like, if you're there for me, yeah, like, that's the part where it's fine at the start, then it, from there it goes off. Shawty want a million dollars. Shake me, say make a wire. Shake me. Shake me. Sorry, I'm sorry. Wait. She said that one line with me as well. Shake me. It's a sound effect. Shake me. It's a sound effect. I actually don't know because I'm not Nigerian. No. Like, I don't know, but <laughs> shake me in it. So you want a billion dollar? You gotta say shake me. Is just more of him. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm really doing it. He's violated, guys. I I'm hope really David doesn't watch this and comes for you. No, shake me. Shake me. Shake me. Everyone knows. But you she said it's someone. Okay, cool, say. So I carry on playing it. Yeah, let's hear the bit that I hate. It's nice at this bit, like. I hate it. 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 That's actually the part where I turn off the whole song. Do you know what it is? Yeah? I'm I feel like, like, okay, change the song now. If maybe. I did it like Afrobeats, I'd understand where it's coming from because the beat gets a bit different and... It's like there's too much going on. Like, the start was okay, like, then it just sounded like a primary school rhyme. It would give me primary school vibes, nursery rhymes. So do you think it's a flop? No, no, it, okay. So you know what, it's, it's half, we're going to go with half a book. I feel like because you've heard it all the time. Vibe is a flop for me. Mm. Um, productions... A uh, bot because you have to value production when it comes down for beats and lyrics. If you're there for me, you for there like, for me, like you should be there for me. That's what you're supposed to say. I like what you're saying, but well, I think the lyrics take are it off okay. the nursery rhymes. So it's half a bot for me. Okay, okay so mm. this one is by my husband, the love of my life. Does he know he exists? He tweeted me on Twitter that other day. Let, let, let it happen. Let, let it happen. Yeah. But yeah, the love of my life. I'm um, just one by Whiskey. Wait, is that the one who I said I know his song with Drake? With yeah, yeah, else? yeah, yeah, yeah. That's him. If, yeah, I know him. Whiskey, yeah. Um, and some other people. I think there's some to his um record. A lot of Americans like him. He's really, Whiskid. he's really, really good. He's really good. And like, he's, he's fashionable. It's called Soke. This this one you did, there's some new dance that's come around here. It's called Shaku Shaku. I don't know if you heard of it. Shaku Shaku? Yeah, go for it. I can't even do it, I don't think. Unless I've had a bit. Shaku Shaku? Shaku is like arms and legs. You do something and you do some, you know, it's some foot movement. Well, Shaq can do it. But, Good. Yeah, let's just let's get into it. this one. This one's not really meaningful. Like, I don't know. They all have this holy water thing, innit? <laughs> holy water, they love it. Yeah. 
It's not a personal favourite. It's not good, especially out of all the songs you played so far. But I like Wizkid as an artist because I've heard some of his stuff. The Drake song. <laughs> this is what I've heard. Come closer, guys. Is that Afrobeats to you? Let me know in the comments. I was just saw. Because that ain't Afrobeats. On Apple, it says <laughs> Afrobeats. <laughs> Whatever, whatever that is, it has, has to be. It's, it's some. Does it not say it? But yeah, anyway, cool. And um, we'll give him, we'll give him a bop because he deserves it as an artist, as his, as, as his artistry. Like we're gonna give him a bop. Um, lyrics, shaku shaku. <laughs> no, I don't think the lyrics are all that. I wouldn't be offended if he didn't give the lyrics a bop. Lyrics, we're gonna, gonna leave that as an NA, not acceptable. <laughs> And we're gonna give the production level good. Can you give me good production levels? Okay, so this one is. You're gonna know this one. I feel like everybody knows this song. It's cool. GB Under Lover. It has all that dancing movement produced by MB. Is that of my the one where people that are really definitely. killing the ground? The people really the kill themselves for this. Like, people really, really, really dance because it has a whole routine. We're killing the ground for it. But I can't dance. Mm. Briefly, I can, but yeah. I like this one. It's, Okay, let's hear it. So let's I'm get the into lover. This. <laughs> it's the same. <laughs> this kills me every time because it just really hits you. Like, yes, we can. I'm just like, wow, okay, so that Afrobeats warriors are gonna die. They're gonna come, they're gonna run, they're gonna yeah, run, they're gonna, they're gonna push they're each other, they're gonna die. Like, mm. Ooh. But you know, it's very different when you hear it in like the proper speakers. Yeah, yeah, it's it's not a headphone song, man. It's a party song. It's a yeah. I think it's. I know. I'm not gonna lie. The, my uni's full of Afrobeats warriors. I hear this every week, every weekend. They really like doing the Afro warriors that like, really get that. Like, <laughs> I don't these. think you could ever hear the song yet and <laughs> stay still. It's, it's funny. I like. I like it. I like. I like. I, I've grown to like it. Cause I've even learned the routine. Cause I just see people around. Yeah, you just it. even just learn it by accident. Like literally, everybody knows the routine. It's like viral. I don't but know. What is he saying? Like, I don't understand the word. Somebody called Amanda. My girl's called Amanda. He's here in the You're corner. You're telling me say that's English. Yeah, fam, it's, it's, it's 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 mix it's, mix. It's pigeon. That's what the Africans call it. It's Nigerian. It's pigeon a Nigerian it's, language. Do you know what it is? Is they speak it in Ghana, Nigeria, and Sierra Leone. Like African boys know how to speak it, but then in your country, there'll be like a different dialect. Yeah. So, yeah, but there are a lot of the words in pidgin, if I was to say it to a Nigerian boy, he would understand what I'm saying, even though I'm Ghanaian. Okay. But I don't really speak, I just understand it. Just like. It's like some, a, the swami you have. Yeah, some boys that I've been around, like be it cousins, uncles, what, I've just picked up and I understand. Uh, but should we do one more? One more, yeah. Okay, this one. This is for last song. This one is by the legend. Let it king. Shout out Wale. Is that Shatawale? No, I he's the that dance, was the name of the song. He's the dancer king in Ghana, yeah. He is a crazy That's guy. That's why you even went wrong, because why thoughts with the name? He's the dancer king, but we love him, man. This song is. And really his name is Shatawale. I thought he was in a song. He's an artist. Does he say his name in the song? This song? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, let's play it. So, yeah. Shatawale. Freedom. Okay, I'm not gonna call that bot, but I'm gonna tell you from now. Are you serious? I'd, it's just one of the dancing songs that we just have to go. It's one of the ones where you know I'll be at. You know what? Let him have it. Let, let him have it. I'm 
think it's definitely one, but I think it's another one. Like if I heard this song, even Shatter if I was wall, pissed like. off, I would dance. Even I if know it's like, it because of the big, because Lloyd did it in the big clash. Oh, I haven't watched the big clash. Yeah, that was Bob and Flo. You know what? No, no. Okay, you know what? You know it has given me a nice little impression to leave with, because she did play me a nice playlist, which shows that she makes nice playlists. So, Guys, yeah. check out our SoundCloud for real, like. My SoundCloud, my Apple Music playlist mania, man. But my SoundCloud is better for my playlist because I don't have that much following on. Do you specialise in Afro beats? Yep, yep, yeah. <laughs> yep, yeah. yep, yep, yep. And yeah. Stop, like, my friend try and make us up like, oh, Tamika needs to make me a. Uh, what's this girl? Jo jo <laughs> so I'm not this girl that everyone's all talking about on Twitter. She has braids, yeah. Jo jo Joanna, Joanna, jo Georgia, no, jo 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 wait, Georgia, wait. Georgia Smith. Georgia Smith. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was just like, who? <laughs> like, I know if I saw a picture, but I don't know. I could not see she made. Song. She's in like um, Drake songs. She was in this whole album. Lovely for her. Well done, girl. She made a song Stormzy recently. But yeah, it's just Afro beats. Like, I like other music. I'm very into music. Mm -hmm. Like, a musical girl but anyway. Afro beats. Afro beats is, is my fave. Okay. So that's what I specialize in. That's what we play on our show on Represent. That's what I play on my Snapchat most of the time. So I don't Snapchat to make a boss man. Follow me on Twitter to make a boss man. Follow me on Instagram to make a boss man. So yeah, um, I did give my I did I did try like literally only one song got a flop, didn't it? Which or two? One or two? I think. I it's only like two songs I flopped out of everything. So I think I gave it a good chance. The first one I'll definitely have a listen to the one with Kojo, and I'm gonna look into Afro dancehall. Because on a realistic level, what I could listen to in my headphones on the train. Yeah, Afro Dance Hall is the, the nearest for now, for now. Le for the now. Production was good on all of them. So oh, yeah. Oh, was it helping us? Yeah. <laughs> let me know what you think. <laughs> let me know let, let me know what you think. Don't cuss me out. Um try, I tried. Yeah, don't cuss me either. Um let us know what you think in the comment section. Check her out. Yeah. You know, you know, all this stuff's gonna be on the screen. And yeah. yeah. I'll see you next time. Um if you guys want a part two, obviously let me know. Yeah, let me know or something else you want us to do. Yeah, do. yeah, to me the character, you know, as you can see. I am, trust me. This is just my first ever YouTube video ever. Is I it? am very nervous. Like this has been very nerve wracking for You're me. You're a radio host. But they didn't see me. Okay. Do you know what I mean? They didn't see me. They didn't see but me. But they see your picture in that thing that they put up on Graham and all that. Yeah, but no, more time. It's like two of our, two of our we have. To. Yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. But yeah, man. Let us we'll know. see y'all later. Like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> what you came in to say? I've always got it to say it. Okay, yeah, for real. We'll like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. And we'll be seeing you in a bit. Bye, y'all. Are you with me?